And let's see, Dave Stahl, he is hanging out outside. Yes. So Dave Stahl is on the show. Dave, you're about to tell us about some program that helps newly licensed drivers improve their driving skills, right? Have you been out on the roads lately? People yes. cannot drive. No. <laughs> so Ford said, this is ridiculous. Let's do something with the kids today. Ford Driving Skills for Life, been around 18 years. They've been coming to KUSI whenever they're in town for probably that full 18 years. We got my good buddy Steve here. You're with the Driving Skills for Life. Or actually, you're the big dog in LA. Yes, sir, with Ford Motor Company here in the LA region. Yeah, and you just, they just said, you're coming down to San Diego. <laughs> But this is such a phenomenal program. And when I say it's for the kids, it is. But you encourage the parents to come with them. Yeah, it's a really exciting program. We've been doing it, as you said, for 18 years. Mm -hmm. And uh, teen uh, deaths, uh, the number one cause of teen deaths is traffic fatalities, right. vehicle mm -hmm. fatalities. Mm -hmm. And so 18 years ago, we decided, hey, we need to have a program to help reduce that. Mm -hmm. um, so we've invested, in the, just in the last eight years, uh, $60 million in this program, taking it around the country to try and help teens understand how they can be safe behind the wheel, what they need to do to make sure that they don't put themselves in a tough position. Right. So at this, we're up in Oceanside right now. Mm -hmm. We've been there all weekend, we're there today, uh, and we're helping both the teens and their parents understand some of the things that they can do to be more safe on the road. And so we take them through uh, exercises that help them understand uh, some of the, the how to recognize hazards on the road, what it's like if they're impaired mm -hmm. when they're driving, what some of the impacts are. So it helps them be better drivers and safer drivers. And, and the, now I have to tell you folks, you're not going to like this, but they're totally booked today. But I re recommend you at least go and observe, talk to the instructors, bring your kids, because you can sort of get a peripheral education on the outside. Wouldn't you agree? Well, you're absolutely right. And the other thing that's available, if you go to FordDrivingSkillsForLife.com, which is where you can register in case there are some spots open, there's also a lot of online training ah. that you can take through our academy to help build some of those skills, even if you can't do the in-person training. Right. And it's so, so important to bring the parent, too, because the parent will learn something. Because let's face it, back when I was a kid, we used to physically go out and drive a car to get our driver's license. Well, that's all gone away. And for whatever reason, California thought parallel parking was difficult. They eliminated that, too. Yeah. So it's yours is not. A lot of people, when they say, ooh, driving, it's all about speed. It's not. But the instructors you use are qualified drivers. They're all professional drivers, many of them race car drivers. Right. They know everything about driving a car, and so they can teach the kids from a very qualified point of view right. how to do this. But you mentioned the parents. I mean, I took my daughter, my 16-year-old yeah. daughter, Edie, to the uh, deal yesterday, and I learned something because she made fun of me because I passed the turnoff to get to the deal. And, and when I got there, I realized I'd been distracted right ah. there in front of my daughter. And so that was a big part of what they teach not just the distracted, but also the impaired driving. Oh, put so, those things away. So this is a fun little exercise that they go through where this these goggles are designed to, uh, to simulate what it's like if you're impaired, whether oh. drugs, alcohol, and the effect on your vision. So the teens get behind the wheel, put these on, Ooh. and go around a cone course that they've already driven without the goggles, and they get to see how many cones they knock yeah. over and All what right. the effect is. We gotta go, we're gonna get you on radio. <laughs> hey, if you wanna see more about this, you can always go to my YouTube page, but right now I'm gonna go to break, and I'm gonna try to learn some more things about cars. DrivingSkillsForLife.com.